that's the shit right there. Oh, oh God, okay, this is harder than I thought. Oh my God. What in the name of all that is atheistic do we have here? Got to keep the body active and flowing and the mind pumping and all that jazz. I don't know, my words are everywhere, but the gyms are closed, man. This is the only fucking way to do anything. Yeah, but you're a lazy fuck who never went to the gym in the first place. In fact, you don't even go on fucking dog walks. Yeah, you know what? Oh God, no, that's that. You might have a point there, but... Oh, Jesus, why would I need to go anywhere? You know, why, why would I ever want to go on a fucking dog walk to begin with? I mean, just go to a random field with a bunch of strange ferals chasing after some bulls. Now, nah, I'm all right, thanks. I got plenty of bulls here. Oh, come on. That's not what I meant, and you fucking know it. I'm not sure that I do. I mean, so many things seem to be changing here that I have no idea what I still have right and wrong. Nope, still as ace as can be, if not more so. And soon, hopefully, maybe, I'll be a leaner, greener, meaner ace. Whatever any of that means. I mean, maybe. It does seem to me that all you were doing was squats and nothing else. Though. I mean, it's a compound exercise, so it, it, it does more exercise stuff. I mean, sure, but what about other things? Like, you know, push-ups and stuff? Uh, yeah, I, I'm not exactly at that point yet, but you know. Oh, okay, maybe sit-ups? Uh, see, that could work, but I feel like I need some sort of incentive. If I'm just sat down, I'm not going to want to move, so. I mean... You could do those sit-ups where your legs are up on something and then each time you do one, just take a poor picture seeing as they'd be on display like they always fucking are when you're sitting around. Oh, oh God. Oh, oh no, this was not a good idea. Oh God. Oh, touch your toes. Oh God. This better make for good shots. Oh, God. Oh, hold on. Hold on. No, 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 no. Oh, shit. Fuck. Wow, damn, yeah, that could actually work. Like, holy shit, if I did sit-ups every time I took poor pictures, then I fucking hell, I'd have like a six-pack by the end of the fucking week. Well, maybe not that soon exactly, but yeah, maybe. But what about... Um... Wait, 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 hang on a second, wait a minute. Why is this all about me, exactly? <laughs> well, I mean, you're the one who stood here doing all of this shit. Yeah, but I mean, what about you? Don't you want to join in with this and, you know, get fit again? Well, I mean, you know, it, yeah, I mean, it's a thing, but I mean, you know, with everything that's, I mean, and you're clearly so, you know, I mean, you know, you know how it sort of is. Uh, it's just, um, yeah. Okay, okay, stop talking like you work for the government and answer the fucking question, all right? All right, maybe I'll try some stuff and see if I can get in the swing of it, but honestly, I'd just rather go to the actual physical fucking gym. Well, I mean, tough shit, bitch. <laughs> We're in a fucking lockdown, all right? The gym is not an option. Okay, we've already gone months without having access to the gym. Still got a few months ahead. We can't really keep putting this off forever, especially when we keep stress eating. God, I hope your fucking enthusiasm for this dissipates quickly. You get so tiresome when you're like this. Well, I mean, maybe I will, maybe I won't. Who knows? But for now, shut the fuck up and get to working out, fat boy. You really want to throw stones like that around in, in this glass house that we've built for ourselves? What I mean, am I wrong? Am I, am I wrong? I mean, no, but you don't have to say it that way. Jesus. Well, I mean, with some hard work and consistent effort, you can make it so that I can never say anything like that again. I mean, shutting you up is certainly a damn good motivator. Hell, you can even turn it into a competition if you want. See who can do the best or the most or whatever. Yeah. All right. I could see that working. I'm up for that. But, I mean, next week at the earliest is when I could start it. I mean... Not now, I've got a fucking pizza on the way, so... Oh, for fuck's sake! Ooh. Oh. Oh, damn. Holy shit, that's... That's really s snowy. I only got that. I'm waiting for so many good shots as well. I hey, hey! Alan! Oi! Dick, where the fuck is he? Dickhead! Boy, I'm right fucking here. There's no need to shout. Uh, oh. You, um... How long have you been there? About as long as you have. Right, right, yeah, of, of, of course. You didn't even fucking notice, did you? Well, I mean, you do kind of blend into the scenery a little bit. Ever the fucking charm are you, eh? Well, you do! So, what name bullshit are you shouting at me for now? The snow! What snow? Y you know, the, the snow. S snow. We don't get snow, boy. It happens like once a decade, okay? And 
We're too close to the sea. It never settles. Yeah, but everyone's talking about snow. There's like a shitload of fursuit photos and whatnot. We should we should be doing the same thing. See, that's the problem with you only sitting in here, isn't it? Like, have you actually looked out the window today? Why the fuck would I want to do that? If I open the fucking curtain and look outside, there's a 50-50 chance I make eye contact with a heroin dealer, for fuck's sake. Well, I mean, not in this area. It's mostly weed around here. If you want heroin, you've got to go further towards the train station. But, no, if you... In, on a serious note, if you actually looked... Out of that fucking window, you might notice that we have sun and not a single fucking snowflake. What? Not, not, not even a little bit. Not even a tiny, tiny bit. But we've not even had ice, for fuck's sake. But it's so fucking cold. I mean, it's freezing out there. And you're telling me there's not even a hint of interesting weather. No, apparently it's the proximity to the sea that does it. It means we never get anything. Also, how do you know it's cold? Okay, right, this is a weird concept, but um, trust me on this. I do actually have perception of what's going on around me. You literally didn't notice I was sat here. That doesn't count, right? I, I know when it's cold, and lately it's been fucking cold. Okay, that's good to know, because I was actually starting to get worried that you had no sense of temperature. What makes you say that? Well, the fact that you keep buying summery shit for me, like the Zori sandals, those fluffy sandals, and the new fucking pair of flip-flops that you've gotten, despite how cold it is. But I mean, they're cheap at the moment, because, you know, no one's buying them. It's because it's too fucking cold to wear them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, but when it warms up, you're going to be so, so fucking glad that you have them, honestly. I mean, I guess, but what makes you think I'm going to be wearing them everywhere? Because, I mean, it's it's you. You're turning into just about as big of a foot show off as I am. Trust me, that's literally impossible. You will always seize the crown away from me without even fucking trying. And that is one crown I'm always happy to wear. But for real, why do you keep buying these things when you know I can't wear them this time of year? Like, you do realise we're not all covered in fur and, you know, warm in general. I don't know, I, I, I guess it's like wishful thinking or something, you know, like, you know, it's, it, we, we don't really have the option to wear them at the moment, so therefore it's it's something that you want because, you know, oh, I just can't have it. And, you know, it's cold, I don't like it when it's this fucking cold and freezing. I just want it to be warm again. Get back in those comfy fucking things, you know. They're the comfiest things that you can wear that aren't slippers in this town, basically, you know? I mean, you're not wrong there, I guess, but I've been out in that cold today and I'm not opting for anything that isn't warm. Yeah, exactly. Slippers. No, well, I mean, yes, because but I'm home now. That's why. I mean, I don't have to go back out, so it's fine. Which, honestly, is for the best. I mean, what if it snows? It's not going to. Yeah, but what if it does snow? It won't. But what if it does? Stop getting your hopes up, boy. This is Weymouth, all right? It's a town built on disappointment. Just be happy that we're inside and we're warm. Ugh, I guess. And I mean, I'm always appreciative of the warmth and being cozy. Especially if it did end up snowing. Oh, for fuck! The fuck are you doing? Just getting ready. For what? The apocalypse? Quite possibly, boy. We have been teetering on the edge for quite some time now, and it's probably about time we finally got on with it. Wait, seriously? Do, do, do I need to go and Mad Maxify the car? No, you fucking donut. I'm going out shopping. Uh, oh, okay. So nothing even half as exciting as the goddamn apocalypse then? No, just dull... Boring, annoying shopping, really. Well, have fun dealing with the general public. Bunch of self-entitled whiny bastards that they are. They're not always that bad. Yes, they are. I've met them. I mean, all they ever fucking do is bitch and moan about shit, and nothing's ever good enough for them, the whiny pricks. As someone whose whole job is to bitch and moan about subjects, uh, you might want to be careful throwing stones in this massive glass house that you've built. Look, all I'm saying is that the public are assholes, and you need to know how to deal with them properly. What, and... Um, you're the perfect person to show me how to deal with people. Okay. Well, yes, actually, my no-nonsense method seems to be completely flawless. Yeah, it's also wildly inappropriate most of the damn time. Yeah, well, so it's a smack in the jaw, but in some circumstances, it is the best way to solve things. So, what? You're, you're the lord of all customer service, is that what you're saying? I mean, basically. Well, right, let's test that theory. Okay, um... Pretend that I'm a customer, and you're a manager, and I'm coming up to ask a question. Ha! <laughs> Piece of piss. Uh-huh. Okay. Excuse me. Fuck off! Please, just take this seriously. Genuinely thought I was. Excuse me. Where can I find the toothpaste? Over there. Right. I've looked over there, and I couldn't see it. Well, you didn't look very hard, did you? All right, turn your ass around, go back down there, and open your goddamn eyes. Okay, okay, this isn't working. Um, let's try something else. Um, right, I know. 
since you're giving me the inspiration. Uh, excuse me, uh, your staff member over there was being incredibly rude and I'd like to complain. Right, okay, no, that's cool. Um, I'd also like to make a complaint about you. So, could I speak to your mother? I assume your dad ran away. So, what, 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 do I speak to you about getting in touch with your mum or do I just go to the nearest Weatherspoons and take her fucking phone number off the toilet door? That's just massively confrontational, boy. Yeah. What's your point? You can't be like that with people. Like the real trick is just getting them out of your life as soon as possible. So I should just run away from them? No, not like that. Because, I mean, I'm willing to do that. <sighs> you see, this is why it's lucky you don't have a real job. Because you'd be fucked within the first five seconds. What? Like proper fucked? Of course not, you fucking idiot. Jesus. Every conversation with you is hard work. So, so much hard work that you want to leave this conversation as quickly as possible? Yes, exactly. Oh. Oh, I see what you, that's, that's actually pretty clever. That actually does work. You play dumb the right way and no one will ask you for shit. Works every time. Is that your tactic for around the house as well? I have absolutely no idea what you're talking about. <clears throat> you know, with the washing up and the cleaning and I mean, everything yeah, else. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What, shouldn't you be going to go and get the stuff and do the shopping thing? What stuff? Whatever stuff you were going to get, just, just go. Just start hounding me about chores and go. Oh, wait, oh, wait. I guess it is. Time to venture out into the world of people. Good. And just remember, play dumb, and if that doesn't work, then, you know, use the back of the right hand to just, you know, that, that clears people out of the way. That's just... I mean, maybe. 